Hi, it's Mitch from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Tigers versus Astros Major League Baseball matchup on Saturday, August 26, 2023. Here on YouTube, I do tons of free pick videos, so be sure to subscribe to our channel. We do free picks every day, sportschatplace.com, pickdogs.com, right here on YouTube, as well as across social media and our live shows. And when you give out that many free picks, you're bound to like some games more than others. And to find out which games those are, as well as to get best bets from the world's best handicappers, head on over to our website, pickdogs.com, Click on the Premium Picks tab. While you're there, use the discount code PICK. You'll get 15% off all of your purchases of $19 or more. We also have the Pick Dogs Dime Club. This is meant for larger better. So that means it's not for everyone. But if you think it might be for you, we have a toll-free number you can call. We have a number you can text. You'll talk to a live person. They'll answer all your questions. But let's get to this one. It's the Tigers taking on the Astros. Eduardo Rodriguez on the mound for the Tigers. Hunter Brown on the mound for the Astros. The Astros doing what the Astros do kind of hanging around hanging around and it's like even though we have seen them absolutely get blown out in games and play absolutely terrible like that 17 to 1 loss to the Red Sox overall the general direction has been up and when you get close to the postseason oh man you don't want to be tangling with the Houston Astros because this is a team that's been there done that and has a lot of players with a lot of postseason experience so if they can knock the Astros out the Blue Jays the Mariners the Rays the Rangers and everybody else they can get the Astros the heck out of there they know it's going to be an easier path to the World Series not that it's ever going to be an easy path Hunter Brown gets the ball here for the Astros this guy Justin Verlander is his idol and he models his whole pitching style and everything after Justin Verlander unfortunately last year we saw some of that Justin Verlander in Hunter Brown this year we've seen a lot less of it and he certainly has been hittable um, a lot more than what we saw last season coming off of a, an outing last time eight hits six runs against the Seattle Mariners he had a shutout before that and then before that five runs against the Baltimore Orioles so when he's played two of the better teams two of the playoff teams Eh, he really hasn't been all that great. And of course, facing a Tigers team here, that's not a playoff team either. But this team certainly has backed down from nobody. And, you know, while the Tigers certainly, you know, like I said, not a contender this season, certainly a team that will be on our circle list for next year. Because while we talk about some of the other teams with the great young pitching staffs like the Mariners and the Marlins, I'll tell you what, the Tigers have a good young pitching staff too. We just probably haven't seen them healthy and together yet. And, you know, you got to remember, their number one guy, Casey Mize, he didn't even pitch all season. I guess we could say the same thing about the Orioles, who John Means didn't play all season. But anyways, I expect this one to be a pretty good battle at Comerica. But, I, you know, I don't love the way the Astros have been this inconsistent. And I know they, these are the games they absolutely need them. I don't think they get this one. I'm going to take the Tigers, and that's going to be my free pick. Of course, while you're doing your picks today, putting your bets in, be sure to use our free betting tools at sportschatplace.com. Our betting tools are 100% free in the way they work. They show you just how often all the bets on the board today actually hit. Then they show you today's odds, and from there, you can assess the risk-reward, putting yourself on the bets that come in the most and pay the most. That's how you make money betting on sports.